but it's not looking too good you know because the enb is not enabled you know now if you want to enable your enb then press shift plus f12 from your keyboard and then as you can see this is enb off and this is enb on hey guys sim what is here welcome back to the new video so in today's video i am going to share with you another beautiful enb graphics mode for your grand theft auto san andreas well do you want to know what will be system requirements let's talk about the system requirements so first of all listen carefully the minimum system requirements in order to play this mode well now you will ask what do you mean by minimum minimum means lowest setting as possible lowest resolution as possible you know so you need at least 2 gb of ram any dual core processor and intel hd graphics well if you have this type of system requirements then you can 100% play this graphics mode into the 30 to 35 fps i'm absolutely sure about that now let's talk about the recommended specs you know the recommended specs is you need at least 4 gb of ram any dual core processor and 1 gb of graphic card you know yes you need at least 1 gb of graphics card if you want to play this graphics mode into the 1920 to 1080 and full hd graphics you know so you need at least 1 gb of graphics card Let's talk about the features this mod offers. Well, this mod offers you HD sun flare, HD water, HD reflection, beautiful color mode designed by me, beautiful time cycle designed by me, HD sky, ragdoll animation, GTA 5 hood and weapon wheel mode, and many more things you cannot imagine. You know. Now let's talk about the software you need in order to play this mod. Well, you need at least DirectX 9. So make sure your PC, your PC have DirectX 9 installed on your PC. Well, if you have already, and you will not face any type of problem, you know. So without wasting any more time, let's get started to the video, guys. Now I have seen many of my viewers are watching my video without subscribing to this channel. So what you doing? This is the perfect time you need to subscribe to this channel. So make sure to hit that subscribe button and set the notification to all so that you, my friend, never miss any of my future upload. And we make this type of content in daily basis. So make sure to check our channel in order to receive some good mods. You know, we don't make the fake content; we make the right content. So. Without wasting any more time, let's get started to the video, guys. So, my friend, as you can see, we are in our desktop screen, and first thing you need to download all these files from the given link in the description. So, process of download is very easy, easy to download. So, make sure to check the links in the description. Now, once you downloaded all this file, make sure to extract your optional file into your desktop or any specific folder you want to extract. Now, once your file get extracted, open your extracted file and then open your game directory, my friend. Now, once your game directory has been opened. Open your optional folder and search for your Slio ASI Loader plus Mod Loader folder, and then just navigate or drag and drop all this file into your game directory and hit on Replace if it asks. And then you are all done. Now go back and search for the graphics fix. Now from here also just drag and drop all this file into your game directory and then you are all done. Now from here what you need to do is go back. and search for your azel trainer now if you want to use now if you want to install the azel trainer then make sure to open slio from your game directory and then just drag and drop all this file into your slio folder and hit on replace if it asks okay now go back from your game and from your optional folder too now search for your widescreen fix.asi now just drag and drop all this file into your game directory and then you are all done now go back and search for your enb fix now this will fix your crashing issues while launching your game or or if your game is not launching then launch enb.exe and your game will 100% start you know now minimize both of this window and then extract your main mod now once your mod get extracted open your extracted mod and then open your game directory my friend from here just drag and drop all this file into your game directory and then you're all done hey don't replace if it asks Now we'll show you the gameplay. Now, whenever you will launch a game, make sure to launch enb.exe. This will fix your all error, or in order to avoid all the errors, please make sure to launch enb.exe. Also, let me announce you something. Uh, if you are facing a lot of error, or uh, after installing the enb.exe, if your game is not launching. Then please make sure to download my GT San Andreas link in the description. Also check you have DirectX 11, you have DirectX 9 or not. If you don't have DirectX 9, then unfortunately you can't play this graphics mod on your low-end PC or any PC, you know. 
so make sure you check them out. Okay, so my friend, as you can see, we are in our game and the graphics looks too awesome, isn't it? But it's not looking too good, you know, because the ENB is not enabled, you know. Now, if you want to enable your ENB, then press Shift plus F12 from your keyboard. And then as you can see, this is ENB off and this is ENB on. Oh my God, the lots of massive difference, you know. So, oh my God. Now, let me show you some features of this mode. Now, if you want to access this Leo menu, then from here, press Ctrl plus C from your keyboard and then you can actually access your Leo menu. Now, in Leo menu, you can do anything like uh, teleporting from here to there or to your waypoint, uh, spawning cars, god mode and everything, you know. Now, I have given you a simple trainer, you know, that is called as RGL trainer. Now, in RGL trainer, you can do anything lot like changing times changing the speed of time okay now if you want to change your car car of color then please make sure to use rcl trainer and from here you can change your color of your car oh my god it's looking too awesome isn't it now let me show you some ragdoll animation you know now let me type some cheats oh my god okay there we go oh my god as you can see there are gta 5 weapon wheel mod so you can actually access this oh so as you can see here guys ragdoll animation so it's, it's too good isn't it so that's all for today guys thank you so much for watching till and i hope you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the video then what are you doing make sure to hit the subscribe button leave a like on this video share this video to all your friends so as always i'll see you in my next one till then goodbye take care and see you all.